Hi, this is Bill. And in this video, what I want to do is go over the switch to the marketplace. If you wish to do so, you can stay on the current model, but the new marketplace, if you want to switch, you'll come over here to this green button on your dashboard and you'll click switch to the marketplace model. We have a notice here that we would encourage you to read. And if you agree to it, click OK. And then you'll be redirected to choose your access pass. You'll see that there are four different passes. You will be able to run one, two, three, or four passes on and use those for different EAs. So go ahead here in the access pass, you'll choose bronze, silver, gold, platinum. I'll go ahead and choose gold. And then for the billing period, you're going to go ahead and choose an option. And for this, we'll go ahead and say we'll be billed monthly. It'll be $300 a month. And we click Add to Cart. Now you'll see your shopping cart. One important point during the switch is you have to have the same products in your subscription that you had previous to the switch. At this point, you will not be able to remove anything from your account, nor add additional things. If this all looks fine, you can go ahead and proceed going through the checkout. If, on the other hand, you'd like to do something like take your affiliate membership and you would like to make that an annual charge, you could go ahead and remove it from the cart. And then here you'll see missing product affiliate membership. You'll click on that. Now you'll go here and you can set it up to an annual payment. Click Add to Cart. And here you'll see now, as you have all of the price breakdown with the proration and coupons, you'll come down here and you'll see that the first renewal is November 18 and this one is on October 18. You'll see that they are on two different billing cycles. And then once you have arranged this the way that you would like it to be, Go ahead and proceed with your checkout. You'll choose payment options and you'll be all set. If you have any questions about the process, you can always go and create a ticket at our help desk. And the website for that is avoriaprime.com support. And they'll get back to you just as soon as possible.